Dorka Yuhaz tips it to herself, and here comes Lou Lopez Seneschal, one of the top shooters for the Huskies. Edwards, Connecticut today. Christie has the big advantage inside. Nika Mule, one of the top passers in the country, leaves it for Lopez Seneschal on the transition three. Respect UConn tremendously, but they're not backing down. They know what their style of play is. They knew what they need to do, but they also knew it would be a tall task to get the win. Edwards with an and one opportunity. We talked about how impactful Edwards is. Long shot, short rebound. She pursues. Looking for an avenue. Nice slip of the screen, and the lay-in is good for Ari Dizon. Almost 30% of the offense for the Catamounts on the season. Screen on the ball, and there you see Edwards gets caught on Gilwee. Great pass to lead Dizon to the basket. Boy, they are looking to get Edwards a touch every time up the floor. This is Dorka. Got it off the window. Back. Gives it up, an open look for three, and that's rattled in by Michael Bust. Emma has started out 0 for 1, and Juhas gets the steal. Edwards the other way. Count it, and a foul. Well, if you're a post lover, you gotta love this. One big with a steal. Passing it to Edwards in transition through the contact including her own. She broke her nose back in October and still wears the mask because she's gotten so comfortable with it. Triple is good from downtown. Edwards knocked loose from behind. Here's Nika Mule drills the three. Michael Bust with the face up. Edwards able to bother the shot. And now UConn with the push. UConn with the numbers. Edwards, good find from Ducharme. Water back, Mule has really been a tough matchup. The Big East Defensive Player of the Year. So Utterback finds the mismatch with Mule and gets it inside to Olsen. That they just got to learn to play together right now. So many injuries this season have not had 10 full bodies in practice for the better part of this year. Ducharme knocks down the triple. Of course, you know, guard play so important in the NCAA tournament. If you're going to get back to the Final Four, you need those guards. And after the point guard, you need a post player. Now to a 20-point Connecticut lead. Baseline drive, and there's Dorka with the swat. Well, this is a connected Husky defense right now, even when Vermont gets a step. Remarkable numbers with the 11 national championships. Mule gets the strip. And the lay-in. Yeah, Mule averaging a steal and a half a game here with the pick. And just no one can catch her. So they stay true to it. We're seeing that now. They're staying true to their system. They just got to see that ball go through the net. Just 25% shooting, only five baskets so far in the first half. And Edwards. Banked in. <laughs> a smile from Catherine Gilwee. That was the best three-point shooting team in the America East, and Gil Gilwee, their top shooter, and again, UConn just immediately gets it into the lane. Continues to be steady, out of transition, seals her defender high. Yeah, their tallest is 6'1", and Connecticut has a handful of players taller than that. And a couple buckets in a row, that one's Michael Bust. She's been huge off the bench, eight points. Another takeaway, Lopez Seneschal with the land. I mean, they've been getting it, everything. Christie points off the of turnovers, fast break points, points in the paint. Connecticut shooting 71% in the game. And Dorka will add to that. Her minutes increased each game of the three she played in the Big East tournament and her return to action. Kicks it out to Edwards and Aaliyah. Lopez Seneschal has it running with Griffin. She'll attack the rim. Short on the first, not on the second. 
Griffin rejected. Good block by Gonzalez. Paula Gonzalez at 5'11 becomes her own rim protector for the Catamounts, and they get out and running. And coming in to watch her NCAA appearance. Lopez Seneschal gets a kind roll. Quick counter, Utterback with the lay-in for Vermont. Edwards to the rim. Olea Edwards, dominant first half performance. She's eight for eight from the floor. Catherine off the bounce. Pass into traffic and a turnover and then given right back. And a miss chippy inside for Bellavito. Lujas kicks it back out to Mule. Offensive rebound. Edwards nine for nine. Nice backdoor cut, Uhaus assisted by Edwards. Assisting on 15 of 22 buckets. And a steal. A touch for Delaney Richeson, the senior from Zionsville, Indiana, to her running mate. Another Indiana native, Utterback out of Greenwood. They've been. Lopez Seneschal. Went down awkwardly. Ducharme may have gotten away with a walk there. Edwards, offensive rebound and one. Aaliyah Edwards is 10 for 10 in the game. Say you gotta box out Aaliyah Edwards. And you just can't stay vertical with her. You can't. For the patella injury to Ice Brady, Fudd hit a stretch of 32 minutes played in three months. Dorka had a thumb injury. It's been an endless stream of issues. Ducharme from Dorka. She ended up being okay. But it's just been one thing after the other for the Huskies and finally all together. That's one thing for Vermont that I'm seeing this half. They have slowed down. I thought they were trying to be too fast in that first half, trying to be faster than UConn because they weren't set screens executing so much better this half. Winner of this one would face the winner of Baylor, Alabama. That's the second game here in stores. What a give and go. Textbook execution for UConn. I bet that was a great example of how the floor was just spread. If you're going to play screen on the ball defense, you got to have weak side there, and it wasn't for Vermont. That's the second time she's banked one in. Shooting better than 60% on the game. Meanwhile, at this end, Vermont has started to pick it up from downtown, Christy. They'll try again and get it blocked. Take it right back. Boy, it's great to see, too, a former player in this tournament and now coming back to coach in this tournament as Edwards gets back on track. Two of them are in their bracket, Iowa State and Tennessee. Fudd rattles one in. On the drive, Utterback with a nice scoop between two defenders for the basket. Just got the impression that Utterback couldn't wait to play in front of this crowd. She said, I don't like a quiet gym. Edwards again off the bounce. She's 12 for 13 in the game. Emma trying back to back and now starting to heat up. Back to Dorka, the nice no look from Mule. They continue to dominate on the block. And have combined for 41 points and 17 rebounds. Pull up is good, short corner, Gonzalez. 26 of the last 27 years. They've been on top. I'm not sure if you realize when you started that whole thing about Seattle 3, you said, what's in store? I thought that's where you were going yes. with it, I'm just saying. <laughs> You know how I love to turn a phrase, <laughs> even when I don't know it. And one, Ducharme. Oh, the spin in the lane, hard off the window. Patterson going to work. Utter back, picked off. Here comes Nika running with Edwards. Founder. Uh, Dorka Juhas and Edwards on the floor together. Two versatile players can spread the floor so good off the bounce, so good.
in so many different ways at scoring as we see you last go to work. Got to beat the buzzer. And they do. Jumper is good. Inesh Betancourt is into the ball game as well here for the Huskies. Mule on the drive. Ducharme. And she'll push to get the four on three advantage. Patterson, layup. And another assisted bucket on the break. Beth, eight times this season, Vermont has shot better from three than they have inside the arc. And that continues with a ninth game here this afternoon. An All-American, Caitlin Clark. That's the one o'clock game and then the three o'clock game tomorrow. Second round coverage. Boom! Bettencourt. Patterson. No, DeBerry offensive rebound. Yes. <laughs> Today was a good day. I'm just not cool enough to From hang with the you. From UConn side. <laughs> nice bounce for Vermont. And Beth, you got to believe that this is what Elisa Gretzky is building here at Vermont. What I love is the community in Burlington completely embracing and supporting this team. Paying off in a big way. Final two minutes here for Connecticut as they prepare to move on to the second round. 28 points on 13 of 15 shooting from the floor. And the Big East champions move on. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.